I'm a gamer and running in circles. I'm a rabbit and running in circles. I'm annoying and running in circles. Might as well jump in the hole and be a bunny. Be a bunny! Hola mis queridos, ¿cómo estás? Me llamo Alicia, también conocido como Coneja. Hello my kittens, how are you? My name is Allison, also known as Rabbit, and today we are playing House Flipper. I am aware we're supposed to have a Dreamlight Valley video today, however, because there was a live stream this past Friday, or this, this week's Friday I should say, I thought it would be a little too much if I did Dreamlight Valley for the Sunday video, so I thought, why not do a double episode of House Flipper? Um, which is fine by me, because I love House Flipper, and, as well as Power Wash. Dude, we have so much of Power Wash to cover, but, uh, which is why next month's uh, live stream will be Power Wash. <laughs> but today, let's play some House Flipper. I'm super excited and also worried. I'll explain why in a minute, but first let me finish my intro. <laughs> Most likely you saw the three photos during the introduction and and you're probably confused and want an explanation or probably don't care about that explanation. I'm going to give it to you anyway. I am at that point in my life where I've changed what I use in my cursing with that I no longer use religious words in my cursing. Just such as God, Jesus Christ, Holy, anything like that. Seriously, with that, I want to make sure the gameplay of House of War on this channel is as comfortable for you over the age of 13, uh, as comfortable for you as it is for me. I am over the age of 18, over the age of 21. There's definitely going to be cursing and cussing, <laughs> as well as adult topics, such so as the previous episode. <laughs> and uh, to explain a little bit further on that, I am aware some of you might think I am dumbing down or PGing myself. I am not. I am simply doing this to respect the Christian religion. And I am aware that I have Christian viewers, followers, subscribers, and whatnot. I want to let you all know I respect you. I really do. Want to remind you all to please respect my decision here. I left the Christian religion on my own volition. There was no external force or anything like that. Like that, seriously. And if you want to learn more about my beliefs, uh, you can check out the video that I have on this channel. Someday it'll be up on my other channel, <laughs> which I look forward to. I'm being procrastinating on that for some reason. Uh, the video is called Ultra Universal. Ultra. <laughs> Fuck sakes, I can't even say it today. Ultra Universalism. Uh, I, I'll have it spelled out in the description box below if you want to learn more. Um, if you want to find the video yourself, because I'm not going to put a link. Uh, I want you to find it yourself. Anyways, let's go ahead and get into the game, shall we? I'm super excited that House of is finally putting out a new DLC. I'm wondering if it's going to be free or not. We'll find out. Ooh, this uh, says this add-on. Ooh, it might actually be free. That's exciting. All right, now I am aware that that I have family that watches my content. Um, my beautiful sister, I love you. Give your give my niece and nephew a big hug and a kiss for me, and tell your brother, tell your husband, I said hi. And I hope that the game that he's playing on Steam is working. <laughs> Because I keep seeing double notifications of the game. <laughs> um, and Ma, I love you so, so, so much. Give Molly a big hug and a kiss for me and tell Newman he will always be a nuisance. <laughs> uh. And by the way, um, when I was loading up the game... It said that it had trouble syncing up the cloud to the game, so I'm worried of how much progress I did with the job that I was working on in the previous video. I didn't entirely close it, it just didn't feel right to finish, it didn't feel right to hit the complete the job thing on it, so we'll have to go back to that cursed house. <laughs> well, I shouldn't say cursed, it's just, it has... It has a certain thing within the job that I just don't like. And I refuse to complete the entire job because of it. So, uh, 
I'll go room by room of what needs to be done with the job. And I'll probably do a couple of additional things to it. Because we'll, we'll see. Um. Pet can't reach target. Where is my dog? Thanks to your good care, your pet Virgil is growing up. Please remember that all pets, regardless of age, need much attention. Wait, did my dog grow up? It does look a little bigger. It still says young. Dude, my dog's a male. Oh, I'm so glad, because the, giving him the name Virgil would have been <laughs> weird. I wonder if you are dirty. Hmm. Let's find out. Pick up. Well, that's weird. Do I need to move this? Is that why I keep saying pet can't reach target? Oh, that's interesting. I think I need to move this. I know. All right. Weird. It doesn't have the call pet to, call to pet for for it. Yes, I knew. Pick up. That is weird. Oh, wait, is it saying that it's too small for it? I suppose that means I need a bigger one. A bigger one. So, with that. Um, care. No pet is requiring washing now. Okay, cool. Alright, so I know I said in the previous video that uh, we would finish the bathroom. Um, as well as a few minor details, but, uh, right now, I want to get back to that job and find out how much of it was saved, because I'm kind of concerned. Okay, cool. And, please, disregard that it says 77%. <laughs> Um, so yeah, this was the state that it was originally in, plus a lot of weeds. Um, we did manage to, uh, do this part of the house, as well as the basement, and gave floor tile, gave, uh, tiling to the floors for all the rooms, 
And I did a couple of extra stuff in the basement uh, to just a little further to get a little further on the job completion. Because I know I told you all that I want to get 100% completion on all the jobs, but there are certain jobs that are just not going to cut that. Because they are a nuisance. Plus, a lot of the jobs on the farm DLC are going to be super hard to do. Especially when, especially since certain uh, properties are so huge and has hot air balloons. That's going to make it super laggy for me. Also, uh, I am a little bit on a time crunch today. I don't know how long I'll be able to record, but we'll find out. <laughs> Oi. I'm already needing some water. Alright. Let us see how much was done. As I said, I'll go room by room, let you all know how much I got done. Let's check the side of the house to confirm everything that I did there. Okay, yeah, it looks like it was completed. Yeah, terrace is completed. Okay, no, it, lo it looks like the save did work. Just for some reason I got that error from Steam. And, uh, I did the flooring in here. And in the previous video, you'll probably notice that um, it, I didn't completely finish the uh, f floor tiling. Turns out, uh, turns out it was underneath this door that I didn't do, which is weird because with House Flipper, uh, the flooring on the on the doorways, pretty much any doorway. It is not considered part of the room, uh, especially when it comes to windows and the sides of the doors. Because if you noticed while I was doing painting on some of the other jobs, the percentage didn't move at all when I did that. So it's kind of weird. Um, so I did the flooring in here. This is supposed to be a bathroom. I, I from what I understand. I'm not going to do anything else with it. Uh, this one, I also did the flooring. And it looks like, oh, there's my brother-in-law. Um, it looks like this is supposed to be a bedroom. Yeah. I see table lamps. Um, and this one is supposed to be a kitchen right here and the rest of the room some type of living room or entertainment room whatever but unfortunately um, it doesn't say it on the list yet but at some point you get um, a text like a little speak overlay from our client saying that she wants something for her pet iguana so, I want to point out why I despise this job. It's because of this big, humongous thing. Like, where the fuck are you supposed to place this? Like, where? It doesn't fit there. It doesn't fit there. I mean, it, it could, but the post would be in the way. Actually, no, it doesn't fit there, because I remember trying that. Um, I could put it there, but it blocks the windows. Just like, where the fuck would you put it? It'd be in the way. So frustrating. Um, anyway... I changed the stairs, um, even though it probably wasn't requested. Put in the windows and a light 
and a switch for it as well. And down here, I built all the walls. And after the video, I put up so, some lights and completed some rooms. This one is to be, whoops, a storage room, as it says in the blue uh, label on the right. Over here is, okay, laundry room, which is also completed. And I went ahead and put in the doors for these two rooms. This is supposed to be the bathroom, and I did the, the wall tiling for this as well. I did all the flooring uh, for this for the basement too. Um, and the doors for that room, which I'm super excited about. Oh yay! It did save. Uh, it saved everything. That's surprising. This room. Is supposed to be a sauna, which I am super psyched about. It's funny because, like, when I did this job on my other profile, um, I mistakenly did like a huge ring, like a huge ring around, and I was like, "How the fuck am I supposed to do this?" <laughs> it's been so long since I've been to an actual sauna. <laughs> like, after I'd completed the job, I searched up saunas on the internet, and I'm like, "Oh, right." <laughs> <laughs> so um and I unintentionally bought more of these benches thinking that it was supposed to be like the rows of the seats and then I realized oh they're supposed to go on the side <laughs> now I kind of want to finish the sauna but considering how we're already at 17 minutes and I'm still talking about this job is kind of bad <laughs> so, uh, I really want to finish this room now that I've started it. So, I think I'm going to do that real quick. It shouldn't take too long. Which is... Eh. Come on. Alright. Um, we need two headrests. And if I remember correctly, I had chosen American Elm. I went to my contrary favorite, which was Sapel, or Sapel, however you pronounce it. Um, actually, I am wondering if it's supposed to go here. Whoops. Yeah, come on. Don't want to waste any more time on this job. Come on. And let's see. Oh, the sauna heater. That will go in the middle. I'm so excited that I'm actually doing this properly. Uh, sauna bucket with ladle. That'll go in front of it. Because you need that water to heat up the rocks. Or sorry, you want the rocks to heat up the water. Um, okay. Nope, nope. American Elm, please. Thank you. And I think these lamps you want for them, so I think they're supposed to go in the corners. Or not think. I know they're supposed to go in the corners. Come on, don't make me be a perfectionist on this. Eh. There we go. I'm so glad this autocorrects. There we go. And I'm not going to bother correcting the positions because I want to get this job done. I mean, I know I said I would get it done, like, I would complete it when it gets halfway, but I think she at least deserves a few completed rooms. <laughs> There we go. Um, and her sauna should be one of them. Uh, is there room on? Yep. And I like things 
I like my light switches to be at an appropriate height, not insanely high or insanely low. That is stupid. Okay. Uh, sauna, sand timer. We will put that... Uh, let's put it in the middle. Yoink. And... Hygro meter. Uh, let's put that up over here. And last but not least, the towels. And you need three of these. What colors do we have? Cream and white. All the cream. I like the cream color. The one. Whoops. Whoops. Two. Damn it. And three. There we go. And complete the job. It may not be the complete job. Uh, complete. It may not be the accurate price for the complete job. But at least I have 78% of it done. The job is not fully completed. Are you sure you want to complete it? Yes. Um, I, I think later on, on my off time, I will restart this job and finish it myself. I don't know if I will, though, considering I hate this job. <laughs> uh, look how nice it looks. Yay. Jeez, look how many weeds there were. Yeah, see, there was... Like a basement entrance there. She wanted that gone instead of just being it replaced. That's so stupid. Cause that closed off, and she wanted me to close it, off, close off the room where that entrance was. Like, don't ever do that, please. Don't ever do that. Cause you will get mold in there, and it will lead, it will spread into your basement. You do not want that. Cuz uh <laughs> one of the channels that I follow, uh J Stu, um I mean their main business name is J Stu Studio, but that's their other channel. Um their main channel basically. But um their second channel used to be called More J Stu, but considering they were uploading on there more often than their main channel, they changed the name to J Stu. Uh, but anyway, uh, their base, which is a, a piece of land that they rented out um, years ago, they still have it, surprisingly, uh, and what they've been doing is basically decreasing the, either decreasing or increasing the property value because they keep putting in hidden rooms. Unfortunately, one of the hidden rooms they made was underneath the barn. And because they haven't used it in in months, possibly years, it got mold in it so bad that they, they literally had to close it off permanently. Which is yaki doodles. <laughs> A chance to change. A hyperactive dog, neighbor's cat, and a pair of imaginative siblings. These are the ingredients for disaster. Especially if the kids are testing their new invention in their parents' bedroom. All doors in the house are open, and the cat has just decided to test to tease the dog and start their daily race. Yikes. Long story short, no one got hurt. The bedroom is completely burned. Renovation is inevitable. I accept the challenge. <laughs> Look what's room was burnt. <laughs> I like the doghouse. Hmm. It doesn't look like there are weeds, but I will give it a once over, then we'll go inside.
I am super excited to buy all of the properties within this within this game. Cause I can't remember if it's the pest DLC or the farm DLC. I have to look it up. I think it's the farm DLC. Um, if you buy all the properties from the farm DLC, you'll get uh, an end resol uh, an end solution, like an uh, an ending to a mystery that c that's kind of within the farm DLC. You'll find out when we start that. But I'm excited to start the farm DLC. And also anticipating it because of all the lag and freezes that'll happen. Like seriously, it got so bad on multiple jobs that it would freeze my game. And I had to personally crash it by force. How did it happen? The answer is Yiri, Silka and their brilliant ideas. And our Yiri and Silik. And the reason is obvious. The boom was so loud, the firefighters were on their way before I even called them. <laughs> you know what my husband said? Panuchka, maybe it's an opportunity for a change. Okay, let's start with his storeroom then. <laughs> Our kids live on top of one another because he has to hoard this garbage. They are growing up. They need privacy and their own space. Yes, destroying walls. Destroying walls and building walls. Love it. All right. Ooh, there are weeds. Oh, no, they're not weeds. They're just dirt. Probably from the firefighters. Whoops. Huh? How'd that happen? Okay, Terrace is done. Still gotta do this, though. Oh, I know I... Yeah. And unfortunately, I haven't started the farm DLC, so I can't go up there. Frustrating. But yeah, it doesn't look like... It says there's trash on the property. I'm not seeing it. Okay, I am going to go to the back of the house. And I'm just realizing that is probably a too close of a view. There we go. Um. Don't know why it says remove trash. Are they asking me to remove this? Oh. I wonder which animal has what name. Um, I think it was... Wow, this is slow. And yoink. Okay. I'm going to redo that, but that's fine. Just give me a second, guys. I thought I closed things off to make sure this game was running smoothly. Jeez. 
OBS really does screw up the lag for it. That's weird. Up, oh, yep, there it is. Get out of here, Microsoft. Um, is that it? Looks like. All right, let's try this again. Still slow, but I'm sure that'll change. Um, yoink. Whee! And put an L. Do a little yoink to know that it's a L. Okay. If I'm spelling it wrong, I'm sorry. Come on. We and A. Gotcha. And save. Beautiful. All right, so I mean, they look like doors over there, but I think that's just the window. We'll have to find out because I doubt I can reach it from here. Yeah, I can't. We'll find out when we get upstairs. But, uh, let's at least check each room on the first floor. Whoa, look at that mess. Doop 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 doop. Wait, is it done? It is. Okay. Alright, let's check each room. Wait. What? I mean, I imagine that's upstairs. And for some reason, it's just showing right there. I mean, that's part of the terrace. It would have said that it's not complete. Right? Yeah, same here. Weird. I guess it's just not on the to-do list, you know. Um, yeah, this whole area is the living room. Let's check if the kitchen needs to be done. Nope. Okay, we're good. Wait, what's that? I saw a door. Ooh. Oh, this is their garage. Okay. Alright, let's head upstairs. It's a room. Sell object, clean dirt. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to do him a favor. These stairs don't match the house. 
I mean, it does, but... Aw, can I not change the stairs? Oh, there it is. Yo, for free. Um, okay, so... That kind of works. Ooh, that definitely works. Me likey. Alright. Yo, what? <laughs> so, um... She didn't say it, which is weird, because I know the last time that I did this job on my free time, on my free profile, on my other profile, I was basically told not to touch that bedroom. Oh wait, no, that's a different job. I'm thinking of a different job. Whoa. Why is it I still see dirt? Okay, she wants me to sell the sofa. Yeah, it still it still looks dirty. I heard an animal. Oh, right there. Huh. <laughs> oh, they actually want to want me to change the walling. Oh, turtle. <gasps> turtle. Okay. We'll do the walls first. We'll do the walls first. Um, okay, so... Um, I'm gonna say three for this wall, because uh, there's a window. One for this. Um... I'm gonna say two for this. And eh. ah. one for over here. Now I am gonna look at the overlay of things. That looks good. That looks good. That looks crooked. Much better. All right, let's start with the window wall. You're my window wall. Why? Why did I do that to myself? <laughs> anyway, what? I'm sorry. I just, that's going to be my favorite quote. Like, out of Herbert Craft. Doc was just so sleep deprived. Deprived. I wonder how long he was streaming that day. Um, by the way, if you're not, if you don't know what I'm talking about, uh, I follow Hermit Craft via um, Vintage Beef. If you don't know what Hermitcraft is, you're not a part of the Minecraft community. You're missing out. You are definitely missing out. 
Because there's there they are on the tenth season right now, and I believe uh, Vintage Beef joined in season four, if I remember correctly. And I believe I joined him. Uh, I think I believe I joined uh, the Hermitcraft community in the fifth season. Because after I found out that he was in the fifth season, I was like, ooh. What's this Hermitcraft? I want to check it out. Um, and then uh, I think at some point during the years I was like, wait, he started in the fourth season? Where's the fourth season? Where can I watch this? And I just couldn't find the playlist whatsoever. <laughs> I don't think he made a playlist. <laughs> and if he does, I have no idea where to find it. It's not on his channel, I know that. Oi. All right, I'm going to go back over there and fix the window. Eh. <gasps> Yoink. That's what I thought. And a yoink. So, I am recording this before the live stream, but I do hope y'all attended. Um, uh, I, uh, shit, I forgot to bring it up in the previous video. Um, there is, I talked about a certain mobile game, I think probably multiple times, if not at least once. Because I do try to talk about the um, multiple g games that I play on my phone. Because, like, I, I want to make sure that those who are part of that community can find me if they want to watch my content. And, uh, one of those mobile games that I play is Legends of the Phoenix. Or Legend of the Phoenix. One of the two. It's, I can't remember if it's plural or not. Um, considering I just call it Phoenix. <laughs> But uh, it's it's a really great game. It's kind of like a fashion design game, um, except there's an actual story to it, and there's just so many like events and mini games that there's just a lot to do, and you're part of a gr and you can join uh, what is called a guild. Uh, I'm not gonna say what the story is, just because it's kind of complicated. I mean, it's kind of like a manga basically, and it's there it's just so drawn out because you're not only playing chapters of it with a certain um feature of the game but you are also kind of learning more about the story through um through companions and partners i I'm so glad they don't use the word consorts. I think they do at some... Uh, I think they did for a couple years. Like, maybe the first year or two. Um, and ironically, I started playing the game... I think during the first year of when it was released. I was surprised about that. Um, and I think last year or the year before? No, it was last year. It was last year. Uh, when I was celebrating my third anniversary of playing the game and finding out it was actually like the third or fourth year for the game itself and I was like oh cool um, and I pointed out the specific date that I started playing the game with my guild because we have a discord server um, and one of one of my guild mates was like told me that she started playing the game on the exact same date I do. And considering we are both obsessed by with cats, <laughs> and considering uh, the majority of the emotes in this game are cats, <laughs> we were like, oh my gosh, cat twins! <laughs> Just because we started playing the game on the same exact date, you know? Oh my gosh. And uh, recently, 
Oh, shit, I'm almost out of time. Um, recently, I found out that, um, uh, I don't know if she's new or not, but there's this other, there's this person that I really like, and I'm super excited that she joined the, the game, just because she is, like, the nicest person you will ever meet, and, uh, she's, like, trying to learn everything about the game, like, asking for help whenever she can, which is awesome. We welcome people with questions because we want to make sure that everyone has a fair gameplay. Um, so she was asking questions about a certain feature of the game, cer certain mini games, and I was super stoked because she and I just started talking uh, quite a bit in the server chat, and um. Uh, sorry, I'm trying to find. There we go. That looks good. I like that. Yeah. Whoop, whoop, whoop. The sound of the police. I think that's close enough. All right. Room completed. Um. So, <gasps> hang on. Oh no, no, no! Can I? Can I? Yay! Ah, oh, this is so cool. It sucks that I can't swing on it. Wee woo wee woo. I can pretend though. Okay. Sell everything. Uh anyway. What? Oh right, I never finished explaining that. Um So this current season of Hermitcraft uh, one of the episodes from Vintage Beef was clearly showing, showing his perspective of the situation he has with Doc. Um, and I think it's Doc? I forgot. And no, it is Doc. Because they're having, like, uh, permit issues within the rules of their server. And <laughs> he's, like, trying to explain his way out of the situation and instead of explaining himself out he like changes su uh, topics by like talking about shows and movies and ends up talking about like Hulu and Netflix and stuff like that some sort of documentary he watched um some sort of British show and just <laughs> by the time he was done talking he was like he, he was definitely sleep deprived I was like what the fuck is going on then I just read like the comments and I was like oh shit Oh, they don't want me to tell that. Okay. They're like, oh shit. Um, he's definitely sleep deprived. I feel sorry for him and all that. I'm like, oh. <laughs> Yikes. So, <laughs> I just... Because it's such a hilarious moment, I just I wanted to see every perspective. Um, I didn't see Doc's perspective, but I at least saw Zombie Cleo's perspective because she joined like towards the end of it. Um... Oh my gosh, just this poor guy. But I have to admit, the situation was entirely funny. Because, like, by the end of it, he was he was like, uh, anyway, what? <laughs> and it just sent everyone but him laughing. Like, he just, he's, he was just so tired. You could tell just by the rant. Uh, anyway, what? I mean, that's definitely going to turn into a meme. <laughs> I feel sorry for the guy. But it's just so fucking funny. Uh, wait, can I? No, it's over 13. Okay, no, we got a good medium. 
because in I think two videos ago we learned that uh, the small bucket contains enough to complete a 13M room but nothing more so that was fun uh, anyway what <laughs> Uh, I will be constantly using that. Uh, it is so much better than w the Wonderwall joke. Anyway. What? <laughs> oh, shit, I gotta be going soon. Um. Let me f finish using the paint on this roller and then we'll look around real quick. Uh, figure out what we got to do with the rooms. I'm just, I'm kind of taking this slow because this game's starting to lag again. Alright, we're done. So let's check the rooms real quick. Uh, an alarm is going to be blaring in a minute. And a half. Whoa! This was the explosion. Poor kids. Uh oh right, the kids were named that Silka and Yeti? Sid Eddie? Something like that. Uh oh excuse me, sorry. Okay. And, uh, with that, um, let's check the other rooms real quick. Um, okay, this is a storage room. We're going to be turning that into a bedroom. Um, what about this room? Nothing, okay. Oh, and there it is. With that, uh, I'm going to have to bid you all adieu. So, uh, if you are new to House Looper, I hope I helped you out at least a little bit. If not, I'm not doing my job. And I hope you all enjoyed this video as much as I did. If so, smash that like button like it gets in wood. And if you're just now tuning into this channel and you're not subscribed, go ahead and click that red subscribe button. Make it that beautiful gray, as well as that bell icon right next to it. That'll notify you of all the videos that I do, which are on Wednesdays, 6 p.m. Central, and Sundays, 4.30 p.m. Central. I hope you all have a great morning, afternoon, evening, or night, wherever you are in the world. I am Sweet Rascally Rabbit. Um... Uh, forgetting to tell you that, oh, I've missed some trash. Uh, forgetting to tell you that I got some perks in between videos. Because I forgot. I, or I gained some skills, I should say. Why am I not getting the all clear? Um, uh, oh, I gotta repair two electrical outlets. Gotcha. Yo. Ah. So much better. And also saying goodbye. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, stay awesome and stay on a YouTube. I'm a gamer and running in circles. I'm a rabbit and running in circles. I'm annoying and running in circles. Might as well jump in the hole and be a bunny. Be a bunny. Yo. Okay. Um. What? 
Right, uh, let me show you the perks real quick. I know I gotta get off, but I wanna show you the perks. Plus, I think there might be, yeah. Yoink. So, I now have all of this. Um, I think I went with... I don't think I gained painting skill. If I did, I'm sorry. I don't remember. Um, cleaning, I do remember that. Nope. Oh, wait. No, I think I did. Uh, I tried, I went ahead and did the building perk in the previous video. Negotiation, no. And the others, I need the, the farm DLC. Or garden. And this will happen with the farm DLC as well. Okay. All right. Um. Nope. I at least want to do the flooring before we go. Sorry. Want to at least get one task done. And hopefully, um, the cloud save will work for the game. I know, hearing that noise in the background is annoying. I will turn it off once I stop recording. Excuse me if you heard me fart. Eeh. I will almost always do this part as well, even though it's not included. Because there's a chance it might. Alright, bye y'all.